Hi everyone, it's Jack, the stripper. Um, the holidays are happening. You have to make stuff because it's fun and recycling is important. I have a craft for you guys that is probably the easiest thing you've never done. We're gonna make stripper shoe planters. I have never done this before. And it's really easy, you just need a stripper shoe. You know what's great about stripper shoes? You probably have way too many pairs. And you know what's also great? I got this one in the lost and found at work. And I, there was only one. So I really didn't feel bad about taking it. Well, I got this dirty ass shoe from someone else's foot, a plant, some soil, and probably some other tools because I have no idea what I'm doing. What you have to do is you have to remove the top from the bottom. Okay, so this is a little bit challenging. Use a cutting board. Ta-da! And it has all these goobers on it. Like any good stripper, just take the goobers off with some nail polish remover. Or you could leave the goobers on because you know what, that just makes it more authentic. You know, people always talk about like selling their shoes to clients who have foot fetishes and stuff. I'm like, I don't have time for that. Do you know how much time it takes to email back and forth with someone who has a fetish? It takes so long. Bitches are, they're so fucking needy and, and they're, they exploit your emotional labor. They have no respect for your time to email. So instead of trying to sell these shoes on Craigslist, for the same amount that you bought them, which is effectively just like kind of breaking even, why don't you make a craft? Plants are wonderful. You're supposed to also like drill holes in the bottom so that there's some drainage, but that's something else that I'm also not gonna do. You could use a spoon to get out the soil, but then you're not getting your hands in the dirt. As a stripper, and any sentient being who lives in this godforsaken city should probably put their hands in the dirt sometimes. It smells nice. You just pop them in there. Your very own upcycled stripper shoe planter. Nobody's mad about the stripper shoe. That was a riot. I hope you guys are just killing it at the holiday crafting. I'd love to see what you make. Please photograph and send me photos of all of your pleasers. These are called pleasers. That's like brand loyalty. And I will see you next week for our last installment of Stripness Crafting. I'm Jack the Stripper, or you can call me the Sandra Lee of Trap Queens, and I'll see you next week.